afternoon and welcome to This Week in Athletics. It's the summer, it's July 10th, uh, 2020. I'm Chris Capaletti, I'm the Athletic Director here at Cuba Rushford. All right, here's what we know right now. Like I wrote, I made my notes, so I wanna make sure I get all this right. All school sports are on pause right now. We know this, right? The NYSPHSAA, the New York State Public High School Athletic Association, has a COVID-19 task force. They have come up with six scenarios. So what does that mean? Uh, we've all heard this. Maybe we'll play spring sports in the fall and the fall sports in the spring because baseball, softball, track and field, golf, tennis, those aren't contact sports. What are contact sports? Uh, Football, soccer, basketball, they're all considered a contact sport. So that's one scenario. There are six different scenarios. I've read them all. They're very comprehensive. It includes all sports. No one's getting left out. So that's very important. Uh, there's a lot of energy and thought. When I read these, I'm like, a lot of good people are working on that COVID-19 task force, and they're coming up with scenarios. All right, so Dr. Zayas. If you don't know who Dr. Zayas is, uh, he's the president of the NISFA, as we like to call it. And you follow him on Twitter. He's always putting uh, information out. All right, so here's what we have. We know that the Governor Cuomo, by August 7th, is going to tell us what school might look like. The governor came out this week and said, by August 7th, he said the 1st through the 7th of August, so I'm just saying it's the 7th, by the 7th, He's going to tell public high schools, will be open, will be open partially, will it be virtually, will it be full. Um, after that, once we hear from the governor, the athletic association can determine what sports will look like. So I know that's four weeks away. Um, it's killing me. This Dr. Zayas, I've met him a couple of times at the yearly meeting. He's a great guy. He loves sports as much as you and I love sports. Just know that. All right, we're all invested. Uh, a couple things, I'm trying to pay attention to the news. What's going on around the country? New Mexico, all right, the state of New Mexico has postponed football and soccer until the spring. I was just reading headlines. Does that mean their spring is in the fall? I don't know, but state of New Mexico made a move. Vermont, state of Vermont also made a move. They've delayed the start of their fall sports. So you can see people are doing different things. Uh, the later we get, the closer we get to that uh, athletic opening, um, the start date of the 24th of August, uh, we're going to see more. We're going to get more answers. All right, New York, we are not sure. Uh, we know that New York State High School Athletics are closed right now. That means no AAU basketball. That means no seven-on-sevens, no summer practices. All right, so we are in a hold, no weight room. Um, there, we are in a holding pattern. All right, I... All the rebel athletes, get out there, stay active. That doesn't mean you can't work out on your own. All right, get out there, work out on your own. We just can't do it here at school, uh, and your coaches can't be involved. But stay active. It's good for you. And when we say go with the season, it's going to be go. So let's be ready. All right, so what are we doing here at Cuba Russia right now? We are preparing to open. Schedules are done. Officials are being assigned. Things have been ordered. We are ready for the August 24th start date. We are going on, so here's a couple of dates, a very important dates. Parent night is August 17th at 6 p.m. That's that night where we all come in, we talk about the rules, we get our paperwork done. Paperwork, oh, we are also, this summer, we're moving to something called Family ID. Now, family ID will be all online. You know the, the health history form, the paperwork you've always done, or the permission slip, um, the code of conduct? That is all now going to be online through something called family ID. A lot of high schools in this area have been using it. Uh, I've talked to their athletic directors and their coaches. It's great. It's a great tool for the school nurse, for the coaches, for the athletic department. So we're going to move to that. So it'll be all online registration. So starting on August 24th, you're gonna be able to register for your sports. Now, that's two weeks away, a lot more information coming on that. August 17th, we're still having parent night. Gotta have everybody come in. The makeup meeting for parent night, uh, the mandatory parent athlete night, will be August 23rd, that's Sunday night, right before we start on August 24th. 
So initial meeting, August 17th, 6 p.m. If you can't make that, then you gotta go to the Sunday night, August 23rd, 7 p.m. meeting. And those are gonna be right here. Uh, I'm planning on right here at the Middle High School Auditorium. Like I said, we're gonna learn a lot more by August 7th. We are planning to start. Things will probably change, but our plans are moving forward. All right, just in case we still have time at the end of this video, lunch every day is gonna be 11 to noon. All right, we're serving lunches. We have room to serve more students. If you are 18 years or under and you're living in our district, you're eligible to get a free lunch. You come to that lunch at the elementary or Rushford Fire Hall. And don't forget, produce pickup will be this uh, upcoming Tuesday. That's every other week. That's going to be all of July. It's going to be all of August. We're hoping, Mr. Leva's hoping to take that right into um, January. But right now, we know it's going to be July and we know it's going to be August. And that's every other week. So we got lunch every day, Monday through Friday, 11 to noon. And we have produce pickup this upcoming Tuesday, right at the lunch spots, 11 to noon. Um, please come get your free, get a lunch and get your free 20 pound box of produce. Uh, that will be Tuesday, but lunch is every day. All right, everybody, that's This Week in Athletics. I'm Chris Capaletti. I can't wait to get out there and play sports again. Pick up the ball, kick the ball, run the mile, everything about it, guys and ladies. Um, I hopefully I'll see you on that field real soon.